Thunder, Thunder, Thundercats. No! Oh my God! What are they doing to Thundercats? I, 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 I don't. I, I have no words. It's just so bad. <laughs> this is Neon, and uh, I'm with Geeky Sparkles again, and we're gonna comment on uh, Thundercats. Uh, uh, what the hell is it called? Thundercats something or other. Thundercats Roar. Um, from Cartoon Network, they just edgy. made the announcement today, and uh, they're bringing Thundercats back, but uh, not like you remembered. Um, they're going for a more cartoony look. It looks very it Steven looks like Universe. The no, it looks like the Amazing World of Gumball. It does look like Gumball. Um, okay, so here, this is uh, from comicbookresources.com, cbr.com. Here's the uh, press release. A Cartoon Network and Warner Brothers Animation are reviving the Thundercats for a new animated series titled Thundercats Roar. The series will reimagine Lion-O and the rest of the Thundercats in a new kid-friendly animation style with a dose of comedy tossed in. Oh my god. Okay, and here's where it gets like, we know exactly what they're doing. Uh, I think the world they built lends itself really well to comedy because of how silly and crazy and outlandish those ideas and some of those settings are. You mean the cool settings that make great toys? God. Obviously, that means it should be comedy. Producer Victor Courtright told Entertainment Weekly, uh, but at the same time, it wouldn't be Thundercats if it didn't have super cool action elements because that's what people come came back to. It's very much something that we want to lean on. So with the new show, we're not walking away from the action any bit. Every step we take towards comedy, we take two more toward really cool action scenes and explosions okay. and lasers and action. Actions okay. effects. I can't take these people seriously as action as as oh, I, I God. I, God. It just I <laughs> What in the hell am I looking at? Like, look, I, I I don't know. This is a trend. Like, you know, I mean at the end of the day, they're doing that you know they're doing this because uh Teen Titans Go is a huge hit. Okay. Yes. Um and so they're definitely giving Thundercats the Teen Titans Go uh, treatment, but like, I mean, is this is this what like Cartoon Network is gonna be doing from now on? Is just taking like beloved IP and action, yeah, established and IP like and making them look like very cartoonish. Um, I'll just play like a couple seconds of the clip here. I'm not gonna run the audio, but they have a video. If you go out to CBR.com, they actually have a uh, uh, trailer for it, and yeah, so um, yeah, this is what we're looking at. It looks almost exactly. He looks like Darwin. Well, that's what I'm saying. It's like it looks, and where the Amazing World of Gumball, I do like. It's a really funny show, and that works for the Amazing World of Gumball. That is not Thundercats. I don't know what the hell they're thinking. I, I think, really don't. I think they're thinking. Oh my God. Uh, I don't even. I, I can't. I can't do this. Um. So this is more. Yeah. Teen Titans Go on the wall. Thundercats War. Well, yeah. It was the same um, network. Duh. Yeah. So the guy uh, in charge is this. Hold on one second here. When he pops his face up. Here. I mean, I. Victor Courtright. So Victor Courtright. Now I have no ill will. Oh, he's got man bun. Okay, never mind. <laughs> no, I had no ill will toward no. Victor Courtright until I saw the man bun. No, um, I still don't no, have, I don't ill have any him, but... ill will toward well, Victor Well, then he Courtright. worked on good stuff. I mean, we he did. Up Here's his IMDb. Um, and he worked... It's all Deadpool. And he did work on, like, Mad, which was actually really funny. I liked Mad. Yeah, now we'll and go to the good stuff. Mystery we'll... Science Theater and Aquabats. Aquabats is cool. Aquabats were hilarious. Cool. Uh, Mystery Science Theater is cool. Um, but then we get to we get to Pickle and Peanut. He worked we... on Yo Gabba Gabba, too, and that's Well, fun. Yo Gabba Gabba's fun. But Pickle and Peanut is bad. It's bad. I hate Pickle and Peanut. I do not oh, like Pickle and Peanut. Pickle and Peanut's, like, one of the worst things on TV. It, it's like the shows uh. keep getting dumber and dumber and dumber and dumber. And I don't... No, I think... I think no, they, they are... I think they get cheaper and cheaper and well, cheaper yeah. and cheaper because animation is not cheap. You look at the animation style, uh, you know, Teen Titans Go uh, uses uh, flash animation and you compare that to what they were doing with, uh, you know, the original Teen Titans, which was a crazy expensive show. It was anime, it was a very expensive show to produce. And even the last time they rebooted Thundercats, which is more serious Thundercats. Yeah. I mean, this is like a complete it, 180 It actually made sense from Thunderc for Thundercats. Right. And and that was, again, a very expensive show. So we're looking at this and we're just like, yeah, I think Cartoon Network is just kind of... I mean, I'm not going to say it's going to be bad. I don't know if it's going to be bad or good. Um, I'm not going to go like, oh, you raped my childhood or any of that crap. But, you know, I, I'm just looking at this and immediately I'm thinking, this is like budget cut theater. This is They're doing this to because they I... figure if they just do the cutesy little cartoons... And, you know, Teen Titans Go is such a huge hit. And, you know, well, they own Thunder... Well, tens of you ask on Teen Titans Go. Uh, yeah, a lot of the, the original Teen Titans fans are... Like, I wouldn't mind Teen Titans Go if they had Teen Titans Go, but they also produced another, like, 10 or 12 episodes of the original series. 
Uh, because you know fans want it. They've asked, been asking mm-hmm. for it for years, and instead they get more. Our son go. grew up with both, and he prefers Teen Titans. Yeah, he does. He hates Teen Titans Go. Yeah, he does. Our daughter like, loves oh. it though. So. Well, Cartoon Network's turned into like the Teen Titans Go channel. Like that's I swear to God that's the only show or, that's or, on. Or uh, Adventure Time or whatever. Adventure. You know? Well, Adventure Time's ending. So yeah, this but the thing is, be... it's like, but they keep picking these shows. Like Adventure Time started out good, and then it just went all whack. Like I don't even know what that was. I mean, it was just it went crazy, and I don't even know. But I'm just saying they keep picking these things and. Like, is this going to be the new thing to replace, like, Steven Universe or something? Um, yeah, because I've heard that, you know, and I, I, I like Steven Universe, I'll, I'll admit. I like, but Steven Universe is not the cheap Flash animation. Steven Universe actually is pretty, I mean, they've got, it's got simple character designs, but it's a pretty expensive show to produce. So you don't see episodes very often. They sort of, you know, trickle them out uh, over the years. But at least Steven Universe has, you know, like a plot. It's not just playing it for laughs. Well, um, I mean, I'm thinking about, you know, they look, they look like they're trying to be, like, simplified, like, and I'm thinking like oh, almost like um, Gravity Falls, but Gravity Falls Gravity is Falls, still way better than this. Gravity, and I love Gravity Falls. I love Gravity Falls. Gravity Falls was like the last best. I mean, I do like Steven Universe quite a bit too, but um, I don't. It's it's just, a, I think Steven I, Universe is. Eh. I like Gravity Falls. It's okay. I mean, it's a little kind of up its own, but I think Steven sometimes. Steven Universe. Yeah. Yes, I agree. Yeah. <laughs> Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm not, I mean, I grew up watching, now they said that the Victor Courtright said he grew up watching Thundercats. He was born in, like, 1984, according to IMBD. You did not grow up watching Thundercats. Well, <laughs> you know, reruns. reruns, maybe. But I was freaking, I was freaking there the afternoon they premiered Thundercats. I remember, because they had, they had commercials for it for weeks leading up to it. And I was freaking there watching that. No, actually, it was. It now was, you're talking about how old you are. I know, but I'm just saying, like, I was there, man, at the beginning. But they actually had a, uh, it was either one hour or two hour movie. I remember it was a movie first, and then they, they brought the series out. But, like, um, it was such a classic, and I just, I, I'm just, I mean, I, I get, I'm definitely not the target audience, but I'm just like. Well, no, apparently little kids are. Yeah. I mean, they'll well, probably I mean, sell I did like of, Gumball, but I don't like Gumball as Thundercats. Right, right. I mean, um, I just, I don't understand why they keep having to take things like... Man bun. They don't get... Would you leave them alone with the man bun? <laughs> I don't understand why they keep taking things like, you know, like uh, established IP and then turning around and like doing that to it. And they keep doing it with these shows and I don't understand why they keep doing it. And if it's not on here, like Gem, they made that stupid movie that was like a yeah. you know, CW special and it was horrible. Well, we could, I mean, we could talk about this briefly. We, we didn't do a video on it yet, but they also... Uh, was it today or yesterday? They showed the uh, trailer a, for the Netflix Shira reboot. It's not a trailer; it's a picture. Or the um, the, the just a picture, and Shira is in the shadows, so you can't actually see what she looks and like. Her sword's in the air, and there's like all these like different Rainbows color. Rainbows coming out. I of think it. it's supposed to represent the other um, the other colors of the other. Powers, pri- yeah. It's no longer princess of power; it's princesses of power. Right. And they're and they're not. They don't want to be like you know with, with, with dramas about your boyfriends and stuff like that. They never had like, drama it, about know, boyfriends. There Shira- was Bo. Bo was, Bo was an idiot. Amb- Bo was in bad, it's ambiguous sexual, you know, orientation to begin he with. He was a Ken doll with a porn stash. He did. That was he Bo. Was. He was. Okay, and his action feature, because I had, when I was a kid, I had a Bo uh, figure. Yeah, I did too. I had a Bo, okay, because I had, I had He-Mans, and I had a couple of Shearers just because they crossed over, but I had Bo, and freaking Bo, like, his, his battle action was, his, his heart, heartbeat. his heart throbbed. <laughs> yes. Like yes, you, you push him until there's a throbbing. It was in yes. both. He would throb, and um, and, and, and if you're to throb, at least be in a good place. You know, he's just, <laughs> he was just like, I guess it could have been worse, but uh, you know, he was like, yeah, he was like the only yeah, dude so on the show. They're bringing Shira back to Netflix, and I'm really hoping they don't kill Shira too, because it looks like they're gonna kill Thundercats. It, Shira looks very. Now we haven't seen too much of Shira, but Shira looks. Uh, the art style is definitely gonna be really cartoony. Now when they said it was Netflix originally, I was all excited because I'm like, oh. Voltron's pretty kick ass. Voltron's pretty good. Yeah. Voltron's really kick ass. So uh, if it's that like anime animation style and they update it for new audiences, yeah, I'm completely on board. And then they they well they told us who's working on it and we're like, <sighs> yeah. And then we saw pictures of uh, the art. Yeah. Uh, and it's again they're like they're making it simplified to be in more you know to be less expensive. Right. Right. And it does not look like Shira. And yeah. I'm I mean yeah, it could be Shira. it could be Please wrong. Don't kill Shira. I think it's gonna I be cry. Shira as Steven Universe. And again, I I. I like Steven Universe, wait, but wait, wait. oh my god, is that the ice cream, ice cream truck? Ice cream trucks here! <laughs> oh my god, it's like being a child all over again. We're watching Thundercats. And Thundercats ice cream truck. and the freaking ice cream truck is going by the house while we're recording this video. 
don't know if it'll pick it up. I don't know if it'll pick it up or not, but my childhood, my childhood. No, but like, yeah, uh, it's just, um. And I'm not trying to like threat, because look, I'm not trying to bust on other people's work, whatever. It I'm might sure, be good. I'm sure there was some corporate Maybe. mandate, like, you know, what IP do we own and how can we make it as cheap as possible? And hey, Teen Titans Go is like really popular. So let's, you know, put all those things in the blender and see what. I they have to keep taking what... I, a beloved IP and, and then, re, you know. I just, I just want to cut it off. Do you anyway. leave the man bun alone? <laughs> the guy, he's allowed to have a man bun. It's not, it's not a crime. <laughs> um, I do hope they, you know, one thing I, I, I always felt bad about with She-Ra is that they brought two new toys out and they didn't give them rooted hair. Yeah. That so, angers me. I don't no, care if you've you got don't this like giant, Well, you can't see it at our uh, uh, desk in the corner. We've actually got that San Diego Comic-Con, that giant. I haven't opened um, it, but I want Massive to. She-Ra doll. She's like, what, like a foot tall or something? I don't she's know, got but I, I want to open her so bad. Well, she's but like the action figures, they right released her and stuff, and then they didn't, they get, they gave him molded hair. And I'm like, no, that this, you know, that, that, see, that offends me. So you can't go by my judgment on these things. Yeah. Cause I'm offended by molded hair of a rooted hair. So, you know, you can't. Yeah. Tom just keeps looking. Yeah. It, it looks like, yeah, it's, it looks like it's Darwin. Fl it's flashy. It looks like it's Darwin. Like, yeah. His facial expressions, they totally look like Darwin. I just. Yeah. Look, when he does the eye thing, it looks like Darwin. So this is coming. This is coming, folks. This is Cartoon Network. This is what they're doing. That's how I feel about it right um, there. That, that pretty much sums my like face. Like giving it the stink eye. It's got the red hair too. Uh, I mean, it, it might it, be the good. The sword it was might... his mouth, and it was, and it was like, crap. Uh, That's yeah. Me. I just, I mean, this is kind of disappointing because we had this, and then we had, you know, Shira. I don't know what to think about that. And then we've got um, now the live action Teen Titans, which looks like a freaking train wreck, judging yeah, by the I'm trying not to costumes look, look, that looks like really I'm bad cosplay. I'm trying not cosplay. to look at that too much because that make me upset. I'm just like, I don't understand. But again, we're not the target so audience. So I'm trying to think kids. what they're going to try to ruin next. What are they going to try to ruin next? Um, um, they're basically just pick a random property from the 80s and kidify it and make it cheap and funny and boom. It's a hit. I'm just so. trying to think what they're going to ruin next. Like what Transformers. Popular... Well, that, that's they, been well, that's already been, you <laughs> Transformers know. Transformers yeah. is shot. Um, what else are they going to try to ruin? I'm trying to think. What else would they try to ruin? Um, wait, My Little Pony. They, they've, they've, already, all... they've already gone and done that. <laughs> they I don't know if it's ruined, they but they I mean, ruined they've it, already they gone and reimagined. Re I don't I'm know if there's much left um, of it. Because they just, you know, it's almost like we got stuck in a time warp. It's like. Well, they did He-Man. It was good. When the two thousand, the two thousand two, whatever yeah. He Man series was awesome. It was. They're supposed to She-Ra, and then they got rid of that. I mean, they should have kept that She-Ra. Well, I kind of, um, I kind of put that up there with, uh, with uh, Voltron, where that's like a reboot done oh, right. You know? I got one. Rainbow Bright. They haven't killed that one yet. No, they tried bringing her back as like a sassy. Oh, that's right, they did. As a sassy team. Did they even make a show of it? No, they did pilot and it was horrible and it never got picked okay, up. Okay, never mind. They tried killing that too. I'm trying to get something they need edgy. Yet. Well, they kind of killed the Care Bears. They made them like all like uh, like freaking Doc McStuffins. Yeah, because Care Bears were pretty edgy. They used to, they used <laughs> to Bears... fight Satan with their stomachs. I know, um, right? So like My Little evil... Pony. My Little Pony used to fight Satan, dang it. Now they have tea parties and, and you I know. know. French. Well, no, French actually the new shows. Yeah, the, the new, new show they did. The new show they did. So, I mean, that's the thing. I well, I admit that new show is pretty good. Look, I'm an older dude. Like, obviously, this is not for me, right? But I'm just like, when my kids are even looking at this, like, what? They the were. They what? were like, what the heck is that? Like Thundercats. My no. son's like, it looks like it looks like Gumball. And and they'll, like, watch yeah, it. they'll watch it because it's on TV. You know, they'll watch it because it's on TV, and I'll I'll try it. And if I don't like it, maybe I'll just you'll like it. Maybe you'll be here. maybe you'll be happily surprised. <laughs> I'm praying for that for Solo, and I'm praying that for Shira. Please, dear God, let one of them not suck. So anyway, anyway, that's else? it. People were asking us uh, what our opinions are. Our opinion and I'm was just not like, very high. I don't even this. know what this is like a tumbler gasm right the here. Eyes like, look this like is... eggs. He's like, I'm sunny side. No, up. this is like this is like Tumblr fan art. Like this is what all the cool kids, well, not cool, but the kids are doing on Tumblr. That was it. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, <laughs> so there you go, people. But the, logo, but the logo doesn't even like the top part looks like the old logo. Go back up, and it doesn't fit with the rest of it. No, it's like Thundercats. No, what I'm saying, though, look, the, 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 the head from the yeah, original, I know, I know, and it doesn't even I know, fit. I know. It doesn't even look like it matches the rest of it. They don't even put the, they don't even put the, because they can't, the, 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 the attention to detail's not there. I mean, I get, I get, again, that it's not the original show or whatever. I just really wish they would just Hurry be up, like. Perhaps something not cheap for kids. Just. But their parents uh, would be like, oh, you gotta watch this, because I watched this as a kid. Yeah. I mean, it might, it might be good. Who knows? I don't know. I don't know. But they're going to. I don't know. <laughs> They're going to have action, but it's going to be comedy. But it's going to have action, but it's going to be comedy. Uh, it's going to be Teen Titans Go with Thundercats, basically. Is Pretty what much. It's going to be. Just hope at least Teen Titans Go gets uh, you know a few good jokes in there. and and uh, But I still would like to see the original Teen Titans. So I don't know. I don't know. But that's it. That's uh, Thundercats. This is a new Thundercats. Um, this is what's coming. Uh, I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. Do you care? Does anybody actually care if Thundercats gets a reboot? I mean... 
you know, it's 2018. They had a show, what, seven or eight years ago. They had a new show, which actually people seem to like, but uh, I don't even know if anybody cares about Thundercats anymore, so... We'll see. But I don't understand. If we just did it not that long ago, why would you do it again? Because money. <laughs> you know, money. So subscribe to the channel. Again, we do uh, pop culture yeah. videos. Uh, do you know gaming. what would be good in that style? Huh? A muscle show. Oh, my God. Yeah, like Kanuki Man. Like the Japanese like muscle. Like the little muscle. To yeah, like yeah. They were, it was figures. Kanuki Man. It was a, it was a, they actually had an anime of it. Not actually... I would, I would totally be down with that. There that we go. So see. that's what you can do. You can bring back uh, uh, Muscle or Kanuki Man or whatever um, it was called in Japan. And yeah, so that there we go. Good thinking. Style. See, this is why they need to hire Geeky Sparkles uh, as executive editor of everything. I'm, I, I don't get hired because I'm not the right person. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. I only, have one, I only have one privilege point of being a woman. Oh, no. Well, this guy's got a man bun, so... That counts for two purposes. How is this happy it was a guy that was getting to do it? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to lie. Okay. So, anyway, um, yeah. So, Thundercats is coming, whether you want it or not. Um, I really, I'm, I don't know, whatever. <laughs> so, That's not my opinion. Thundercats, so, whatever. Thundercats, whatever. Uh, subscribe to the channel. As long as I have runes. Is that what you're going to call it? The, the video, Thundercats, whatever? Thundercats, whatever. I don't know. Probably Thundercats, no. Yeah, Thundercats, no. is probably <laughs> so, more appropriate. So, uh, subscribe to the channel. And, uh, yeah, check us out for more uh, videos on pop culture. Uh, lots of opinions and uh, gaming videos and all that sort of jazz. Bye.